Hey guys, Josh, sorry for the shaking camera. It is cold out here. It's 10 degrees and I stopped at this wildlife refuge on my way to a client. Give you an idea how cold it is. That lake behind me is frozen over. <laughs> so the reason I'm recording this is to invite you to a prayer gathering that we're hosting at Shawnee Park on December 26th at 7 p.m. Um, come out and join us. We're going to pray for the needs of the homeless. We're gonna pray that God plants wisdom in our city council as they try to decide the fate of the Simon Kitten building. And more importantly, we're gonna pray for God's will to be done uh, in all the regards, um, especially around the homeless. Um, we're not only gonna pray and give it the respect that it deserves, but we're also gonna praise him that night. So I really want to invite you all out. Again, the Shawnee Park, 7 p.m. on December 26th, which is uh, ironically the day after Christmas, where we celebrate the birth of, of Jesus Christ. Um, and ironically, even he, needed a warm bed to be given to him that night so, so he could be born. So join us again December 26, 7 p.m., just a few days before the council meets and decides the fate of that building. Even if you're not a religious person, I've seen some people, some people tell me that, but even if you're not a religious person, um, God is still listening when we, when we speak, when we pray. And I'm always said that um, most, most people are just one answered prayer away from being true believers. So... All right, guys, it's cold. It's 10 degrees. The lake's frozen over. And I'm going to continue to pray out in this as long as they're still sleeping in it. In the eye of the storm, you remain in control. And in the middle of the war, you guard my soul. You alone are the anchor when my sails are torn. Your love surrounds me in the eye of the storm.